Hey YouTube, today I'm going to be showing you how to make a star generator so it will generate stars all over the screen in random positions. So what you're going to want to do is turn the stage to any color you want, but I'm just going to make it black because that's the that because that's the color of space. And then you're going to want to delete costume one first, paint a new costume, and delete costume two. Okay. So now you're going to, so now I'm just going to zoom in and paint a right uh no a yellow um a square. So I'll come back when that's finished. Okay, so when you're finished, you're going to want to go to scripts and add a when flag clicked. So you're just going to make them go wherever you want, so I'm just going to make them go to X zero Y zero. And now you're, what you're going to want to do is go to looks and have the train, no, set color effect to zero. And then you're going to want to set size to 100%. So now if I drag the, the, um, the sprite over here, he's just going to go back to the center. And, um, if I change the color effect to 50 real quick, and then I'm going to set it back to zero. So now if I drag him all the way over here, he'll, his color effect will change and he'll go back to the center. So you don't need to have a variable, but I will show you the variable first and I'll take out the variable. So I'm just going to name this total amount of stars generated okay so you're going to set that to zero and now you're going to have a repeat total amount of stars generated and then if I um, set it to zero but I change it to a slider and I move it all the way up and I move the amount of the slider to 100 now I have him move to no go to pick random and um, you're just going to need two pick randoms one in the X one in the Y and um now you're going to need how many x and y there is so i so what you're going to want to do is you're going to want it is your uh, to find this out you're going to want to put your mouse in the black area or what or um whatever color you made it then you put it outside of uh, of it and now you can see that your x is now 240 so i'm going to make that negative 240 to 200 to positive 240 and now for the y what you're going to want to do is put it below so now it's going to say negative 180 so now i know that i'm going to do negative 180 right here 